Okay, the core of what we're doing is this is you and I on the road exploring history. Fabulous. All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to do rock, paper, scissor right now. And if I win, we do this entire trip on horseback and wagon. Scissor? You've never played rock, paper, scissor. No, oh, I've never played it's a dumb game. Rock, paper, scissor, uh. Rock, paper, scissor, uh. Oh. <laughs> my name's Jack Osborne, and this is my dad, Ozzy. Heavy metal god, prince of darkness, and surprisingly enough, history nerd. As the old saying goes, like father, like son. So my dad and I are doing something we've always wanted to do. We're hitting the road. Just the two of us and a bucket list of places and things we've only ever read about in books. Oh my god, it's amazing. Or seen on TV and the web. Do you have your knife? Yes. Yeah. Civil days, we might need it. There are no roadies, no tour buses. What the f is this? No boundaries. Oh. Welcome to Ozzy and Jack's World Detour. Let's rock and roll. So me and my dad are on a bit of a road trip to Jamestown. Jamestown was the first British colony here in New World. In doing research, I found that there were four Osbournes living in Jamestown or migrated to Jamestown from Great Britain around 1630. So I kind of think that we could have maybe had some ancestors there. So that being said, onward for the British Empire. Hello. Howdy. Hi, Jack. How was your night? Good, good. You told me that it's Jamestown thing. But what was interesting to me was that it was suspected cannibalism there. Well, the Brits sent a bunch of people over, but none of these people had agricultural experience. No one knows how to grow things. And so 80% of the people that first arrived died. And because they weren't getting supplies and they had a couple brutal winters and they couldn't grow a lot of things, they ate the farm animals and then the pets and then each other, supposedly. People were cannibalizing. Yeah, right behind you here uh, is an open cellar that's been reopened by us. And uh, what we found in, in one of the layers in there was a, a mutilated skull, human skull, uh, and a severed leg bone. Wow. It turned out to be a 14-year-old English girl. There was, so was she dead when the was Yeah, she wasn't killed for it. Uh, there, you could tell from the forensic, the way the cuts were on the skull, uh, that she wasn't moving around. So it was a very desperate time. Yeah. Oh, but, I mean, yeah. I mean, it's one thing to hear about cannibalism at Jamestown, but then when they start telling us that it was a 14-year-old girl that they ate, one thing about eating someone, but she's been dead for a while and I dug her up. Oh. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty crazy to think that they went from like 300 people down to like 60. It must have been like an all-you-can-eat buffet down there. 